All right, hello everybody. Welcome back to Bendy and the Dark Revival. What's up, little dude? Anyways, yep, we're gonna go ahead and get started on the fourth chapter. Man, we are breezing right through this. This is the second day that this game's been out. I've recorded three videos today. What's up, man? This little dude is just making my day. Like, look at him. He's so cool. Look at him. He's so cool. Whoa, dude. This place is ginormous. Bendy's booking it. I think he knows where we're going. Can the Eek Demon reach us out here? <laughs> Can the scarier version of you reach us out here? Okay, let's go ahead and head over to the old engine building. Inspect. It looks like we need to find an ID card somewhere around here. Any ideas, Bendy? It was worth a shot. <laughs> ah. Not in here. It's worth a shot, Bendy. There's nothing in here. Sorry, Bendy. He doesn't care. He's just trying to help. Is he gonna have me look through every trash can? Nothing in here. Let's keep looking. Bendy is smart, though. He is looking in all the places that I would look. Future has arrived. I just didn't know it would get here so soon. Some of the stuff that's coming out of the coming out of gent doesn't follow any of the rules of physics that I know. Hard to believe they started as a bricklaying company once upon a time. Nowadays we have all the modern conveniences and worse yet the headaches the the ID card machine they've got out of the door. You don't bring your ID, you ain't getting into work. So I started pulling my ID card on my nightstand in my room on the downs the downside hotel. It's not the safest place, but at least I know where it is. Looks like we found a clue. Downside Hotel. Pharmacy. Toys. Oh yeah. I'll just start my own place. Hey, what the you little scumbag? My gosh. Two, three, four. Loot the corpse. Where's the downside hotel? Right here. It's kind of creepy in here. Mm -hmm. Boris, yeah, I would like a one room, please. Whatever, wherever Eugene Lloyd was staying. Oh, Whoa. I can flow. I forgot about this. Go ahead and just finish off the rest of my health. Yeah. <sighs> Gotta start looking up, Aaron. Those are pretty helpful. Got it. Well, geez, you haven't gotten far. Don't hey, Joey. do that. Wait. How? How did you get in here? Oh, I have my ways. <laughs> so tell me. How goes the journey? Slow, but I'll get through. Ah, I see you have your father's never quit go getter spirit. Oh, now you knew my father. Well, newsflash, I didn't even know my father. Or my mother. Or anyone else in my family. That's rough. I see then. You've chosen to forget the past. I can understand that. <sighs> what are you talking about? Look. I don't think you're ready for this, but hang on to your lunch money. There's something I want to show you. Okay. Wait, what are you doing? Okay. All right, Joey, <gasps> Joey, I'm here, I'm here. Let's see if we can find what you wanted me to see. Oh, 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 are we Henry? Is there any chance that we're Henry and not Audrey? Oh, we're still Audrey. Over here. Come have a seat. This won't take long. Dude, that was sick though. I mean, I know it wasn't much, but just hearing that, that like yeah. sent chills down my spine. That was awesome. Very old place. Full of memories. But never mind all that. Where's Henry? There's a little story you need to hear. You ready? Here we go. Once upon a time, Audrey, there was a bitter old man. You had lost just about everything. 
Joey. Right. The real Joey Drew. He blamed everyone but himself for his mistakes, but mostly he blamed his old business partner for abandoning their work years and years ago. A man by the name of Henry Stein, great artist and a good friend. In his anger, Joey used an evil machine to create another world. A world made of paper and ink, where he'd torment his own version of Henry forevermore. Jeez. But one day, a miracle happened. An angel came into Joe's life. A young woman by the name of Allison Pendle. She didn't visit often. But when she did, she saw something good in Joey no one else could, including himself. Through their friendship, he began to see the world with better eyes. So one day, in Joey's cartoon cycle of hatred, he gave Henry an angel of his own to guide him when things were most dark. Alice. To always provide hope. It was then Joey decided to make something new. Something he had always wanted, but he could never have. A family. Really? But not a cartoon one. Something real. And after many, many tries, he created something that made him happier than he ever could have imagined. What is that? A wonderful, loving daughter. Ah, that's Bright, nice. Kind, almost human. He created you, Audrey. What? That's... Are you crazy? Listen, I know it's a lot to believe. Who do you think you are? I wasn't born from some machine. Flesh and... And blood. The old, can I'm you not see some yourself? Kind of ink monster. Just because we're born of darkness doesn't mean we belong to it. We're always free to choose to believe what we want to believe. Take me back right now. I'm not listening to any more of your lies. Remember who you are, Audrey. Leave me alone. <sighs> so. Does that story mean that, like, Henry was never actually in the real Joey Drew Studios? It's not true. It can't be. Hey, hold on. Again, I'm being a complete theorist here, but Boris keeps... I hope Boris makes an appearance. But, like, just think about this for a minute. Just think about it. Didn't he just say um, that the guy made versions of Henry to torment? So wouldn't that mean that Henry was never actually there and... The story you were playing was the fake story that Joey drew. Uh, made up. Uh, 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 oh, oh, okay. Where's Bendy? 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 Where did Bendy go? Well, I had a friend for five minutes. Now he's gone. We are the keepers. Can I get some health back for this? Because I'm assuming this is going to be a ginormous fight. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, he's even having problems. Bendy! Wait. You're telling me that small little Bendy is the ink demon? Is that what you're saying right now? That innocent little Bendy is the ink demon. Is that him? Kind of looks like him. Whatever. But is that little thing the ink demon 523 is the door code oh crap this one was supposed to be done there we go I need some food for this
Please have your identification card ready. Yes. Um, hi. Um. My purpose is to live. My name is Audrey. I'm not here to cause you any trouble. Look, I just want to go home. Please, can you help me? Do you actually think that this thing would help you? Shut up. Man, that was extremely helpful. Let me just, um... Who made you? Of course it's Wilson. Can you take me to him? He wanted me to find him. Dangerous. Much too dangerous. What is wrong with these people? This subject is without limits. Yes. Whoa, 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 whoa. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. We're fine. What the heck is that? I gotta find Bendy and Sheep Songs. Spores coming to save me? Does that be nice? I gotta find something that can work as food. So right now, if I try to fight these guys, I'm going to die. I know I can upgrade this. Why won't it let me? Whatever. Oh, what the heck? What the world? What in the Jesus Christ was that? We can't fight it. That's pretty much confirmed. Oh, we can't run from it. Ah! My gosh, that thing's still thing. Can I banish? Can I banish? If I can, I'm going to. Let's me banish. Ah! <laughs> Fine. Man, I just wanted to banish you. There's nothing wrong with that, right? You fast on my trail. But I'm faster. On the trail of survival. I'm slow. Darn it. Okay. Yeah, we made it out this time without being seen, at least. Mm. Made it. To a door. Cycle breakers. Oh, the That's where the ghosts live. Just beyond that door. Okay. The keeper's prison. The pit. 
No one ever comes out. At least, they're never quite the same. But I could open the door for you. I do know how. I really do. Ah, uh, thank you. That would... But, but first, maybe play a game? Oh, I love to play games. I like hide and seek best. Oh my god. Find me, and I'll open the door for you. I promise. Look away while I hide, and no peeking. <laughs> oh, you've got to be kidding me. Got her. This is so exciting. You were brilliant. Now, can you open that door for me? Oh, yes, the door. I think you'll find it's open now. Oh, and also, let me give you something. Something special. Is it food? Just a small reminder of our game together. What was that? Fast travel. What was behind is now ahead. Interact with the linker pipes to fast travel between two specific locations. Dark places you've already been may hold new secrets. That's sick. Okay, thank you, lady. And give me this. Falcon. Poo! I need a health upgrade. I want it back. Say? No idea what that said, but oh, it's the projectionist thing. I think. Yep, that actually is the projectionist thing. That's the noise it used to make when he found you. You guys remember the projectionist, Chapter Three, Benny the Machine? Really hope we don't have to meet him. Who's that? Um, excuse me. Sir? Can you help me? You must be real lost to be asking me for help. Oh my god. I'm just looking for answers. About the keepers, Wilson, the cycle, anything could help. What's your name? Audrey. What's yours? Honestly. I've almost forgotten. My name is Henry. Oh my god! It. Have you been a it's long? Henry. The keepers think you're a threat to their plans. They lock you away. Forever. Please let me let him out. Still, it's giving me time to think. Things like. If you haven't eaten in years, you might not be human. Why would you be a threat to them? I'm what they call a cycle breaker. Once upon a time, I knew how to start the cycle over. And when that happens, everything begins again. Completely new. Obviously, Wilson and the Keepers don't want that to happen. How did you do it? Reset the cycle. Turns out the Ink Demon himself is the key. This world is his. But even he must obey its rules. If you can get him to look at something very specific, it will reset everything. What is it? It's just a reel of film. Called the end. To put the words the end. I can see it in my mind every day. They keep it upstairs in the pit. I'll see if I can break in and steal it. Maybe if I reset the cycle, we could make things better for everyone. And what about you? I just want to go home. So did I. Good luck, Audrey. If you need me again, you know where to find me. That is the coolest thing ever. This is the best game. Huh? Oh, it's you. Bertram, Beatrice, Be Beatrum, Ber... Um. I'm not unauthorized, you're unauthorized. 
If a spider comes out of there. Oh, it's worse than a spider. It's not worse than a spider, but it's just about worse. Oh. Did I die, or was this all a part of it? Well said. Rest yourself, Audrey. You're still weak. The keepers can be relentless to strangers. But there's nothing to fear as long as I'm with you. He's so You're weird. safe now. You did this to me. You brought me here. Turned me into this this thing. This doesn't make sense. I've never done anything to you. Open your eyes and look around you. None of this makes sense. Good point. Drawn walls, nightmarish creatures, an ancient studio that died out almost 30 years ago. It's all fiction, utter nonsense. Agreed. And yet, in here, it exists. It breathes. It flourishes. In that briefcase? Reality. Guided by its master's pin. The foundation for a new reality. We can bleed into our own. Just think of it. Anything we create in here, we can release out there. Are you serious? This world must be controlled, made safe. These things, these angels and demons, Hi, Bendy. are they really life? Or are they just Ugh. stains? Old mistakes ready to be cleansed away for newer greater things what do you want from me i need your help to save my father's life what this huh? is our star we'll talk more once we're safely inside okay that was oddly weird okay so Again, cliffhanger, nerds, ha- Anyways, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you did enjoy. If you did, make sure you like and subscribe. If you'd like to see the previous video, click in the bottom left. If you would like to see a video of me hunting Bigfoot for the 85th time, click in the bottom right. Thank you all so much for watching. Goodbye.